Hi guys, okay, first of all, do not try to freak out by looking at the title or the thumbnail. There is no clickbait. This is the most important video for all the cat aspirants out there. Now, uh, what happens is basically, you know, we study a lot, we write so, so many mocks, we hustle, we slog. But here, my experience is that every year on the D day, Bachalo Kuchna was Galat Kar Deta. So, there are two stages in cat preparation. This is my personal belief and my experience. And this has been happening, like, I mean, it's been proved correct year on year. Two stages. Stage one, you preparing for cat till 23rd November night, right? And stage two, you on the D day. Most of the time, stage one is taken care of, but most of the time, stage two is completely been screwed. And the reason to get that uh, that that stage two screwed is not having a reality check. Trust me, you speak to people, those who have not done very well last year. Don't speak to those who have done very well. Speak to those who have not done very well in CAT last year. They will always tell you that we f we actually did not understand CAT very well or you know, we were not having a realistic approach towards CAT. Now, CAT is not a tough exam. It's a tricky exam. What makes CAT tricky? There is only one element that makes CAT a bit tricky. That's called as surprises. Every year you will be seeing surprises in CAT. And that's the reason if you're serious about your cat, listen to me very carefully because this is going to be a really important video for all of you. Okay, I mean it. I want to help you, right? So listen to me very carefully. Surprises. Even in 2019, you will see certain surprises. Now, cat is known for throwing surprises at you. In last 10 years, you will see every year you have surprises in cat. Even 2019, you will see that if, if there is no surprise, I'll be more than happy. But if there is one, how do you tackle it? A lot of people screw their cat. A lot of people screw their cat. Not because they, are, they aren't a good student. Not because they did not prepare very well. No, nothing like that. They, everybody is a good student. It's just that you could not foresee what's there. Right? Or you could not understand cat very well. Now, in 2018, if you look at it, everybody studied very well for quants. Even those who are scoring very well in quants, uh, in stage 1, in mocks and all that, they couldn't do very well in cat. Why? Because there is a problem. Now, I'm going to tell you that what, what, what the problem was. Now, 2016 quads, medium. 2017 quads, it was way easy. So, that's the first thing. Never ever have any pre-notion or never have any, um, you know, a preconception about an exam in your mind. A good student will never have any pre-notion in his or her mind. Right? Now, when 2017 people went for the exam, they saw quads and they were shocked. And it was a, it was a beautiful shock anyway because... They were surprised to see the level of quants going drastically down. That was a sweet, beautiful surprise that students uh, you know, had. Now, people started attempting more quants, but they never expected that this year, the monster is not quant because cat is known for quant. People are so scared of quant because, because of which they are not giving cat. So, we couldn't foresee that the real monster is going to be DIR and DIR was so tough. People were like really scared of DLR because perception kya tha? Pre notion kya tha? DLR ka matlab kya hota hai? Arrangement, bar graph, pie chart, case slate, games and tournaments, kuch bhi nahi aaya. Games and tournaments is not there from last three years, right? People went for it and that's the shock of your life. Now, on the D-Day, you guys understand, listen to me very carefully. On the D-Day, 60 minutes, dimaag mein kuch tha ki paper aisa aega. But paper exactly ulta aya. What you gonna do? First 15 minutes you are freezed. Completely, you are completely out now, you are not there in the game and that's where I am making this video to make you guys aware that how can you handle these surprises on the D-Day. In 2018, when students went for the paper, right, what happened was they believed that, you know what, quants can never become more chukai, so quants is going to be easy. The moment they started with quants, I mean people were, I mean literally they were shattered, their moral was shattered. They had no idea what to do and what not to do. Trust me. Now why it happened? Everybody studied. Everybody did their own job, right? People could not foresee. People were not ready for it. And those who had experience, those who were ready, they did very well. Those who could kind of you know, take care of them, those who I kind of you know, control their emotions, they did very well. And that's the problem because we went ahead with the cat and we, we kind of approached the exam with the pre-notion without actually thinking about what worse can happen. And that's what happens, you know, when people tell you all that numbers, you know, magic numbers, 8 questions per 80 percentile, 10 questions per 90 percentile, 12 questions per 95 percentile, 
I always tell you that that's the utter nonsense. It doesn't work like that until and unless you know the level of difficulty, right? And you know, to my surprise, if you look at all these guys who are telling you all these things, check out their last three years' video. The numbers are same. Kali ek do number change hote hai. Same score pe, same percentile pichle teen saal se bol rahe. So that doesn't really work. Now this is again a problem for you all. You have to keep these things in your mind and go for the paper. Now, how do you tackle all these things? The first thing is that. You need to understand, or you need to tell yourself that yes, there is going to be a surprise in the paper. How do you deal with it? Now, let's talk about verbal. Verbal may, if you look at from last five years, the paper is actually smooth. Like there is nothing, you know, no hiccups at such. Now, in 2018 slot one, you had around about 14 questions. They were fact based, coming directly from the passage. But in 2018 slot two, you had only seven questions, fact based. And you had round about 17 questions which were literally based on the idea, main idea. Now there is nothing called as inference. In inference hota nahi hai. I made video yesterday. Jisko samjha, usko samaj gaya, right? So there is nothing called as inference. It's idea based. Jahan bhi you need to kind of get a little bit into the RC. You have to read the RC. Again, rules hai. If you are my student, you know what I am trying to tell you. You know the rules. Do mein bhi ho questions nikal nahi hai, right? But the point is that, the moment I see, right? Ki yaar. Fact based the question dikhi nahi rahe Ye to poos rahe what is the main idea, what is the central idea What are the point of view of the author Which argument can undermine the main argument of the author uh, You know what are the hypothesis Aise question to ko bhi dekhi nahi rahe Ab ek ghande mein ek question karne To problem hoga See this is what you might face on the DD Khudara khasa aisa ho nahi But what I am trying to tell you is that If at all you see this Let's say Let's say What if in verbal History gets repeated what if in verbal history gets repeated? I can use questions like 2006, 2007, 2008, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Wherein the questions are based on Greek mythology, wherein the questions are based on economics, psychology, philosophy. Yeah, if you are a C2C student, we have done a lot of RC rules and all that. You will be able to do very well. But that's what I'm trying to tell you. You should be expecting these kind of things. You should be ready for the worst. Right? That's what I'm telling you that you might see certain surprises if you don't control your paper. If you are not getting ready for it, you will not be able to perform very well on DD. And that's the reason 10 days before I am making this video because it is still possible to crack cat and you can still overcome all the surprises. Now what you need to understand or what you have to do for the next 10 days, I'll give you a verbal example. Agar fact based questions aate hai, if the questions are fact based, you can read the passage, you can get it correct, no doubt. Can we, can we just try and do questions based on idea? You remember my video when I talked about death corner, questions with except, you know all that stuff right? Can you guys just try and work on those death corner for the next 10 days? And that's the reason I'm telling you, for the next 10 days, you have to train your brain ki yaar aisa bhi aa sakta hai, idhar bhugli aa sakta hai, ye ghuma ke aa sakta hai, agar aisa aaya, what am I gonna do? What is going to be my plan of action? Because remember, right now jo preparation aap kar rahe ho, right, jo mocks aap de rahe ho, we don't know cat ka level uska hoga hai, usse nature hoga hai, upar hoga. Right? At not a D day, you are going to be a little bit more anxious and nervous. Right? So, if you think from this perspective, ki, yes, surprises aayenge, I am ready for it. On a D day, even if you see the worst surprise on the screen, you are still under control. You are, you are under control, you, you are controlling your emotions, you are controlling your paper, you are controlling your attempts, you are controlling your accuracy because yes, you could foresee, you are ready for the shit. As simple as that. But if you are, and that's what happened last year, people had this pre notion that I have 10 questions, I have 8 questions, I have to set LRDA, I have to set LRDA, so I have to cut off the cut off. And that's what people tried to do. People went to do around about 10 questions, 11 questions, and so on, which is not going So that's where the entire fuck up happens. So my advice to all of you for the next 10 days is I want everybody out there to actually think about these surprises. Prepare yourself. Let's, let's talk about quants. Uh, all the CDC students, can you all prepare for a bit of challenger level question? Don't write them. Don't solve it. Just go through. At least understand the level of difficulty hota kya hai. Question ka LOD badta kaise hai. Jaysay mene, I, I gave you the, uh, I, I actually uh, posted the video today morning when I told you how do you gauge, how do you crack or how do you measure the level of difficulty of your paper. Now the moment you understand, you know what, something is wrong with verbal on the D-Day. The level of difficulty has gone up. You know what? Sit tight. 
reduce your attempt, increase your accuracy. Then you don't go ahead and try to attempt more questions because eventually you will land up in the negative marking and your score will go down. So the piece of advice that I want you all to understand is that I want you all to kind of give yourself a bit of thought, thoda analytical bano, agle das din tak. Your preparation has to be with the reality check. You cannot live in the myth world, right? So you have to have a reality check if you want to score very well in CAT and if you want to get success in CAT. So you think about okay, okay, you know what? ये topic अगर मैं कर रहा हूँ, इसको मैं check. You know, arithmetic. I'll give a classic example. Arithmetic. Arithmetic has always been easy, doable, right? And there are so many people will tell you that arithmetic करो, पढ़ा निकल जाएगा. Yes, निकल जाएगा. No doubt about that. I am also telling you the same thing. Profit and loss के questions देखना last year. Interest, compound interest के questions देखना last year. They were on a very high level. ओके, नो प्रॉब्लम विद दैट हाई लेवल था बच्चा देख के डर गया बिकॉज ऐसे क्वेश्चन देखे नहीं थे पहले कभी हाउ डू यू टैकल इट्स ओके इफ द क्वेश्चन इज टफ यू ट्राई टू गिव सम मोर टाइम टू इट कॉल कैलकुलेशन है कैलकुलेशन करो आंसर निकल जाएगा डोंट फ्रिक आउट ऑन अ डी डे बिकॉज यू नेवर एक्सपेक्टेड दैट मान लो अगर सेम लेवल का क्वांट अगर 2019 में आता है इफ यू सी द सेम क्वांट इन 2019 विल यू फ्रिक आउट नो बिकॉज यू हैव ऑलरेडी सीन दैट इन 2018 सो यू विल बी लाइक ओके यू नो व्हाट सेम लेवल आ गया बट चिल राइट बट मान लो 2017 में अगर आपने कैट दिया होगा और 2018 में भी दिया होगा व्हाट डिफरेंस दैट मेड यू गेटिंग माय पॉइंट राइट दैट्स ऑल आई वांट टू से गाइस दैट्स ऑल आई वांट टू से यू बीन स्लॉगिंग योरसेल्फ यू बीन स्टडीइंग वेरी वेल यू बीन स्टडीइंग अ लॉट वन थिंग दैट यू गाइस नीड टू रिमेंबर सरप्राइज अगर आया हाउ टू स्क्रू दैट सरप्राइज ऑन अ डी डे सो दैट योर करियर इज नॉट स्क्रूड दैट्स इट फ्रॉम माय साइड नाउ वन मोर अम काइंड ऑफ थिंग दैट आई वांट टू टेल यू वेरी क्विकली इज दैट For the fact I've told you all these things, I've made certain videos. They're like really good. The content is amazing. I will be putting them in couple of days. I am not going to tell you what videos I'm going to make because uh, this has been brought to my notice by my students, and I, even I have seen that my competitors are copying my videos, the content, and the kind of uh, you know methods and the strategies. So I will not be telling you the list, but yes, I will be. Putting across those videos, which will help you immensely for your CAT preparation. So guys, for the next 10, 11 days. Let's work a little bit more harder and let's achieve all your dreams. Let's crack that. Thank you so much.